Alright guys, so right now I'm doing a mod review on the hold on. On the Doggy Talents mod. Just a mod where I I guess it's kinda like better. Uh, anyway, I made this is my dog. You, you just take a normal stick, you tame a dog, and then you right click it with the stick, and then you have all this. I made it to level 60. I have this food bowl out here. Uh, looks like he ate already, so I can make him wander around. Um, I'm trying to make him stand up. Um, I'm. I know you could turn him to wander mode, but I'm trying to figure out how to do that. All right. Uh. Uh. Right here, I have a throw bone. Get a couple of these, and you just throw it, and the dog will give it to you. At your feet, he'll play with it, then he'll drop it. Uh, slobbery, a jeweled bone. You put it in your crafting table and it turns back into a throw bone. Alright, so we have that. And, you know, to make them level up, you can feed them treats, a training tree, and you can give that to him until he's too advanced for them, and then you have to give him the super treat, and then after that, the master treat. Alright, so we have command emblems too for it to attack. And this, this just like tame, I mean, spawns dogs. And we have all these emblems and charms and all that. It just spawns another dog for you. Three dogs, looks like. So anyway, you have this. Oh, that shoots snowballs. Alright, so I only want one right now, so... So let's get rid of. If you right click them with these doggy shears, shears, they are released into the wild. As you can see there. And let me get rid of this one too. Sorry, it's kind of laggy and they're running around a lot. So. Alright, so that one should be my tamed one. Uh, where is he? Now those dogs could go do something else. So now this thing that just like commands it to attack other things. So let me test it out with we just spawn skeleton. And right, I think I need to make it. All right, up! Oh, I failed. I'm probably gonna die now. So anyway, let's just. All right. Anyway, so. Yeah, that's supposed to make it do that already. So this is the OK charm, which I think it lets it wander around. Yeah. Or it makes it follow you, I'm not sure. Now this one is the stay. It makes the dog stay. See how it lays down like an actual dog? With his paws bended, his legs bent. 
So we have checkup time, where it lets you check if the pet is um, incapacitated, which could happen. Uh, obviously, mine isn't. And there's another one, attack, which is, it's in attack mode, so watch that. It'll just attack right away. So yeah, now that he's killed, let's get dog. And I think you could do something else also. Can you could let it go on your head? Alright, it's kind of annoying right now. Alright. Skeleton is kind of annoying right now, getting in my way. So let's just kill him really quick. Sorry about the lag, guys. Uh, I didn't mean for this to be such a long video, but it's just extremely laggy, and it's kind of hard to do this. Just put it in attack mode. Alright, it's dead. All right, now that it's dead, let's go get the dog. Now, if you right-click it with the bone, he will go on top of your head. So, that's pretty cool. This is called the bed finder. And with the bed finder, like, it lets you find the previous bed it's seen you sleep on. So that's pretty cool, and there's something else, also. So there's a lot of things. So I think one lets you ride on it. But I forget what command. Okay, so it's wolf mount. And do you want it to have the highest amount of wolf mount? And then you want to right click it with your hand. And the highest level you could do for these. There's a lot of things that these things have. And you'll be able to find that all on this page. It's easy installation. I am pretty new to this mod, so I'm not sure of everything that happens. I think you could change the uh, wolf's color and all that. So let me just scroll down because I kind of forgot how to do the last skill wolf mount. It's the best one, actually. So, uh,. Okay, you have to jump and right click. So you have to jump and right click. I think I have to level it up. Hold on. I'm really failing right now. <laughs> I have to fail. I have to. Uh, I said fail it. No, I have to. Feed it all these treats so that he levels up all the way. All right. Now he's maximum level. Let's get rid of these. 
and if you jump and right click, you mount him. Right, this is basically my favorite part of this mod. It's like a really complicated. Sorry, guys, I got cut off at the end. Let me just get rid of its name right there. So you actually move really fast. This is my favorite part of the mod. This is very complicated. It's just really complicated. But anyway, this makes you move faster. It's laggy right now, but it's not really laggy um, when just um, playing normally without recording. So yeah, wagging his tail, and he jumps higher, he just, you don't even have to jump when he comes to one block, he just like walks right over that, and he jumps really high. Um, alright, so as you can see, you have to kind of be careful, and yeah. Found an egg. And you could feed it with a food bowl. You have to fill it with food. So let me just spawn in some. Alright, let's move him over. So you put that on there. You sit your dog down. You make him stand. Alright. You make him stand on the food bowl until he eats. And when your dog is just home alone or he's wandering off. Like, he can wander off, but... So that, you know, you know how in Minecraft you leave your dogs home, they're just sitting there all day. So you could either have them just sit down at home, or you could have them wander around. And don't worry about your dogs wandering off um, too far. Because... They will, um, they will only wander off 30 blocks away from your location that you, um, wander them off in. So, yeah, it's okay. You don't have to worry about that. As you can see, uh, the dog ate some. And now every time he, um, comes back to it, he will, uh, Every time he's hungry, he'll go to that bowl to eat. So... Now he should wander off. Yeah, now they'll just wander off. So anyway, um, thanks for watching. This was part two of... This mod review. And... Thanks. Thanks for watching. Subscribe.